In this video, I'm going to take you through the intriguing world of IP ratings with a spotlight on IPX7 and IP67. Ever been curious about what these numbers mean for your favorite devices? Stay tuned, because by the end of this video, you'll not only understand these ratings, but also be able to make smarter choices for your tech needs. IP stands for ingress protection, indicating how well an electronic device can resist external particles like dust and water. These devices are vulnerable to such elements, so a high IP rating, signifying strong protection, is crucial for their longevity. Imagine your speaker failing at an outdoor party due to rain. Disappointing, right? That's why a higher IP rating is important. It ensures your gadgets are more durable and can withstand different environments without getting damaged. A low IP rating, on the other hand, means the device is less resistant to dust and water, which could lead to quicker wear and tear. First up, we have IPX7. The IP stands for Ingress Protection, which tells us about the device's resistance to external elements. In IPX7, X indicates that there is no specific rating for dust protection, meaning it's not guaranteed to keep out dust or solid particles. The 7 represents strong water resistance, allowing devices with this rating to be submerged in water up to 1 meter deep for about 30 minutes without damage. This makes IPX7 rated devices perfect for indoor use, such as speakers or headphones for your bathroom or home. However, they might not be the best choice for outdoor activities where dust protection is important. Some popular speakers with an IPX7 rating include the Anchor Soundcore Motion Plus, JBL Flip 4, JBL Flip 5, and JBL Charge Essential. If you're looking for a device that can handle a bit of water, these might be worth considering. Next, we have the robust IP67 rating, which offers advantages over its counterpart, IPX7. The 7 still signifies strong water resistance, allowing devices to withstand submersion in water up to 1 meter deep for about 30 minutes. This makes it suitable for use in adverse weather conditions like rainstorms or snowfall. Now let's talk about the best part. Unlike the IPX7, the IP67 rating also provides protection against the ingress of solid particles, which is a feature not found in the IPX7 rating. The 6 represents a high level of resistance against dust and solid particles, making it the second highest rating for dust resistance currently available. As of now, IP68 is one of the highest ratings commonly available. So, if you're planning a beach outing with family or friends, or simply want to spend some time outdoors, consider getting a gadget with an IP67 rating. Devices with this rating offer ideal protection against water, dust, moisture, and other particles, making them perfect for outdoor activities like backyard parties or hiking trips. You won't need to keep your speaker under a cover all the time, as the IP67 rating provides ample protection. Devices with IP67 ratings are often used in outdoor security systems for their durability. Some popular speakers with IP67 ratings include the JBL Flip 6, Ultimate Ears Megaboom 3, Ultimate Ears Wonderboom 3, Bose SoundLink Micro Bluetooth Speaker, JBL Charge 5, and JBL Xtreme 3. The key difference between IPX7 and IP67 is how they handle dust. IPX7 is mainly about water resistance, meaning it's great for situations where your device might get wet, like near a pool or in the rain. It can be submerged in water up to 1 meter deep for around 30 minutes. However, it doesn't provide any specific protection against dust. On the other hand, IP67 offers protection against both water and dust. The 6 in IP67 means that it's completely protected from dust, making it ideal for outdoor activities where dust and dirt are more common. Like IPX7, it can also be submerged in water up to 1 meter deep for about 30 minutes. So, if you're looking for a device that can handle both wet and dusty environments, IP67 is the better choice. That's it for today's video. I've explored the differences between IPX7 and IP67 ratings, helping you understand which one is better suited for your electronic devices. Whether you're looking for water resistance or dust protection, I've covered all the bases to ensure your gadgets are well protected. If you found this information useful, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing for more tech insights. Have any questions or want to share your experiences with IP rated devices? Feel free to drop a comment below. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next video.